Hi, my name is Sherry Torres, and I'm here at Loops Knitting in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and I'd like to show you how to crochet slippers. With this particular model, I started at the toe, and I did a double crochet ring of 10 double crochets. I then did a standard double crochet increase for the second row using two double crochet per stitch to make 20 double crochets. I continued for eight more rows, crocheting in the round for 10 total rows of 20 double crochets. Then for the heel, I continued the next row by making one double crochet in each stitch for 14 stitches. I skipped six stitches here to create the instep for the foot. I continued crocheting for five more rows using 14 double crochet. When I got to row six, I crocheted halfway across the row for seven double crochets. This is going to be your heel flap. Turn your item inside out. Insert your hook back into the loop. This is where we're going to join the heel flap with slip stitches. Insert your hook into the very next double crochet and also into the double crochet that you just completed, making a slip stitch by inserting your hook, yarning over, and pulling through both loops on the hook. Do that for all seven of those stitches back to the top of the heel. As we slip stitch across, we're working on the inside of the heel, so when we turn it back right side out, this part will be hidden. You'll have a nice hidden seam joining your heel together. Go all the way to the end of the row, slip stitching those together, do a chain one, and turn your work back right side out. At this point, you will work double crochets all the way around this outside edge, a total of 24 double crochets. As you do your 24 double crochets, just continue for six rows, then you can join, break off your yarn, weave in your ends, and you have a nice cuff that you can roll down. This is a very quick and easy double crochet slipper that you can make in a very short time. That's how you crochet slippers.